Hey, Jet fans, come on in. Let's huddle up. All right, we had a tough week last week. This is a new week. We're going against the Miami Dolphins, right? Well, I'll tell you what. Our defense definitely is going to get a break compared to what we saw last Monday night's offense that they had to go against. These Miami Dolphins are banged up up front. Of two key positions, both on the right side. Their offensive tackle, Vernon Carey, has not even made the trip up to New Jersey for the game. The right guard is the backup right guard, replacing the guy that started all year, uh, who happened to be a rookie. I gotta believe that with that line banged up, and with Miami's offense only averaging like 3.7 yards per rush, uh, the defense should be able to play some good ball. Miami's most consistent receiver, Hartline, wide receivers out of the game, even though Marshall will be back. But we need to take advantage of that offensive line and put some pressure on the quarterback. This is the time to step up, folks. It's time to start improving here. The offense, uh, we have room for improvement in our offensive line as well, and they know that. I know the guys are trying hard, we just have to play better up front. Sanchez has to play better too. We saw that he can foul up a little bit just like all of us do, but we need better play out of Sanchez. We need better kicking out of Nick Folk. We need better punting than what we saw out of Weatherford, even though he's been as steady as could be up until the other night. You know, we've got a 9-3 and three record. And that's good. However, seven of those wins have come against teams with losing records and one we're playing here. Miami Dolphins is a 500 team. So we got to start getting better because you got the Dolphins, which are scary because of their defense. They can beat you with their defense. And then we followed up with Pittsburgh, Chicago, and finally Buffalo. But if we don't start getting better, we're not going to be able to continue to compete, especially against the quality teams. All right? Now, for those of you folks that are going to the stadium for this game, man, be positive. Give the Jets some positive vibes. Get behind them. Show them that we still love them. All right? And let's look for some better play out of the Jets on both sides of the ball and at the kicking game as well. All right? J-E-T-S. Go Jets. Ready? Break!